Throughout the entirety of Hypixel Skyblock, there are many, many ways to spend coins to get better stats. You can spend like 1.5, 2 billion coins. I don't know how much it is, but you can buy a Hyperion and you can blow people up. You can spend 1 billion coins and get a Terminator. You can spend another billion coins and you can get a Divin's Drill. Or you can spend 6 billion coins and get something completely useless. Something that isn't useless though is Code Banana on the Hypixel store. If you use the code Code banana at checkout you get five percent off of anything you purchase on there ranks gems literally anything five percent off and that stuff goes a long way for me because it supports me and it lets me feed my dog who is turning a year old in just a couple days here look how small she was she's huge now she needs a lot of food and i spend a bunch of my revenue from codes on her so i'd really appreciate if you use code banana at checkout in this video, I want to talk about two armor sets that are very confusing to me because they really just shouldn't exist with the state that they're in in the game right now. And these are two of the Kudra armor sets. No, I'm not talking about Crimson or Aurora. These are great sets. They're very useful. They have a lot of stuff going for them. Crimson's passive is pretty good. Aurora's pretty solid just because of its stats. And Terror, also pretty good. But the other two sets from Kudra are just objectively the worst way to spend your money and I seriously can't wrap my head around why they exist. The first one that I want to talk about is the tank set, Fervor. If you're trying to go for max tank stats, this is the set to go for, I can't lie there. Health, defense, this thing balls out when it comes to survivability. But the passive and the purpose of the armor set literally just don't exist. The passive is based around blocking damage with your sword and you can taunt enemies and stuff and get a lot of damage reduction. But let's try and block with my sword, all right? So I'm gonna block, oh wait, this sword has an ability. So I can't block with it. Let me block with my Aspect of the Void. Wait a minute, this can't block. What about my Daedalus Axe? Yeah, something like this. Oh wait, it also cannot block. You need to have a very niche sword to be using this. Even the giant sword is not something that you can be using when you're trying to get this passive stacked up. You need something like a Claymore or a just random sword that doesn't have an ability or you're not going to be able to use this passive at all. And then there's the purpose. This is a tank armor set. Tank is supposed to be, you know, the guy who's tanking damage. But where in the world is that meant to be used? Because there is not a single thing outside of dungeons that requires a tank. And what do you know? You can only use fervor outside of dungeons. So if you're putting on infernal onto this, if you're getting max attributes, if you're spending the 6 billion coins that it costs to set up an infernal fervor armor setup, you're setting up something with a very janky pattern passive that requires you to just have a random weapon on you or just use claymore because claymore is a good melee sword but either way it's a jank passive and then you really don't have any spot in the game currently where this is going to be anywhere near useful because as i said you can't use this in dungeons so everything else you can just kind of survive with other armors and this thing just falls off to the wayside I don't know what I'd want them to do with the passive. Don't make me have to use a non-ability sword for one thing. But then when it comes to the usage, they got to completely rebalance the game or just add something else where you need a tank outside of dungeons. Because right now, this is literally probably the most useless armor set in the game. Unless you are just dying in one shot to everything and you want something to tank. The other set from Kudra... Hollow Armor. This is a pretty damn cool armor set when it just comes to the ability because the passive is going to give you the stack of spirit whenever you kill something or assist something and spirit's going to let you use the hollow wand and this is probably like the coolest item in Hypixel Skyblock. I can't lie. It's got the Windcraft casting system where you like click and do like this and you would do different spells but none of these spells are really that great because once again why do you need a healer outside of dungeons? Plasma Flux, Power Orb, or Hyperion is easily going to make you survive anything, so you're not really having some guy chase you around with healing. All of these abilities are fully based on healing or defense. There's nothing where you're buffing other players. There's nothing where you're being useful at all. You're just adding stats that people don't need in the current game's meta. And this is just not great. Maybe if this thing, if it had like a mercy damage boost kind of thing where you just make someone deal like 15, 20% more damage, maybe the wand could be useful. But outside of that, 
there's pretty much not a great reason to run hollow armor. The stats actually aren't too bad when you look at it compared to Aurora. If you were running this for, with a mage setup and you were able to use the wand effectively, this could be a decent armor set. But once again, decent not worth 6 billion coins. It is just not worth the value that you have to put into it. So I seriously just don't understand its existence. I think both of these sets kind of highlight a problem with how encounters in Hypixel are designed because they really would like you to do a lot of the stuff solo because if you couldn't do things solo in the game, then it's just not going to be that fun for a lot of the players who don't have a bunch of friends. But these two armor sets are very built around helping out others. The tank set is taunting enemies away. It is making you the guy who's taking all the damage. And it's meant to be letting other people survive around you by you just taking the brunt force of every enemy. This one is meant to help by healing the other people. But with how the game is currently balanced, people can just heal by themselves. They don't need hollow to actually sustain them up and fervor just isn't useful because once again they can tank by themselves because they heal so darn much maybe whenever hypixel changes how healing works in the game hollow could see a use fervor could see a use but right now there's not a single encounter in the game that makes either of these worth the price when you're making them infernal let me know what you think about this down below would you like to see some buffs going to the more underutilized sets in kudra that's all for the video bye to the three people who have maxed these out infernal wise, you're really cool, but you have a useless armor set. Don't try and change my mind in the comments. You're just wrong.